Hi, we are from At Home Tuition. In this video, we are going to see how to estimate the discount percentages and the discount amount using few examples. A first example is your bill in a shop is rupees 577.80 and the shopkeeper gives a discount of 15%. How would you estimate the amount to be paid? So solution, let's see what is given first. Sale price is given rupees 577.80, that is 577.80 pies and then discount percent is 15%. So you want to estimate the amount to be paid. You have to find the amount that is approximate amount to be paid. So for that first step, we are going to round off the bill. That is we are going to round off the sale price to the nearest tens. Okay, so here if you go for tens, this is 1 and this is 10. So if you go for the 10, that is number is 7. You have to see the next number. So it's greater than 5. So you have to add 1 to this number. So it will become 8 and it's 0. Nearest tens you are rounding off. So 77 will become 80. So okay, so now it's rupees 580. So you have rounded that is to the nearest tens and the sale price will become rupees 580. 80. So, this is your first step. The second step, we are splitting the discount amount as, that is given discount percentage, 15% as 10% plus 5%. First, we are going to find the discount amount for 10%. Then, we are going to find the discount amount for 5%. So, for 10%, we can write it as 10% of the sale price. So, 10% means 10 into 1 by 100. That is for percent into the sale amount. What we have rounded off is rupees 500 and amount 80. So, 10 divided by 100 into rupees 580. So, now we can take it as 10 into rupees 580 divided by 100. On simplifying this, you will get rupees 58. Okay. So, this is your discount amount for 10%. Now you want to find the discount amount for 5%. So now 5% is half of this 10%. You are going to take half of this 10% amount. So to take the half of this to find for 5%, you are going to find the 5% of rupees 58. So you will be half of that rupees 58. So that is 58 divided by 2. That will be rupees 29. So, for totally for 15%, you have to add the amount for 10% and you have to add the amount for 5%. So, rupees 58 plus rupees 29, that will be rupees 87. So, now we want to find the bill amount, right? So, for that, here it is a discount. So, you want to reduce it from the sale price. Okay, you should not add, you should reduce it from the sale price. So, now we can reduce the bill amount that is sale price by 87. It's we have found out. So, because we are estimating it, we can round it off by 85. So, rupees 500 and my 80 minus rupees 85, that will be rupees 495. So, that will be an approximate amount. So, thus we can say that if your bill in a shop is rupees 577.80, then we have rounded it to rupees 580 and the shopkeeper gives a discount of 15%, then the estimate amount to be paid will be rupees 495. Next example is your bill in a shop is rupees 577.80, the same amount. Try estimating for 20% of the bill amount. So, in previous example, we have estimated for 15%. So, here we are going to estimate it for 20%. So, we are going to do the same process. So, it's given sale price is rupees 577.80, that is 80 pies. And the discount percent here is 20%. So, what we are doing is, first step, we are going to round the bill amount. Okay, it's given 577.80. So, now we are going to round to of nearest tens. So, it will be rupees 580. Okay, so now the discount is 20%. So, we have splitted it into 10% plus 10%. First, we are going to find the discount amount for 10%. So, 10% of rupees 580. So, that can be written as 10 into 1 by 100 into rupees 580. So, that can be written as 10 into rupees 580 divided by 100. 
on simplifying this you will get the amount as rupees 58 so this is for 10 percent but the discount person given is 20 percent so what we want to do you have to add the amount twice to get the discount for 20 percent so rupees 58 plus rupees 58 that is rupees 116 so now we can round it off to rupees 115 because we are estimating it so you can take the rounded off amount so now rupees 580 minus rupees 115 we are taking it as a discount so you have to subtract so if you subtract you will get rupees 465 so thus if your bill in a shop is rupees 577.80 and the shopkeeper gives a discount of 20 percent then the estimate amount to be paid will be rupees 465 next example is estimate the amount to be paid if you were given a discount of 25 percentage for a bill amount of rupees 999 okay so the sale price is rupees 999 and the discount percent is 25 percent so we know that first step we want to round the bill amount so here it is given 999 so i am rounding it off to next 10 so it will be rupees 1000 so next we are going to the discount percent it's given 25 percent so i have split it as 10 percent plus 10 percent plus 5 percent so now first i'm going to find for the 10 percent discount amount for 10 percent so 10 percent means 10 into 1 by 100 into the amount is rupees 1000 so if you simplify that you will get rupees 100 so for 10 percent the discount amount is rupees 100 now while going for next 10 percent so it will be again 100 so 100 plus 100 it will be 200 next i'm going to find it for 5 percent so 5 percent will be half of this 100 that's 100 divided by 2 equal to rupees 50. So now for 25 percentage, we want to add all the amounts, right? So rupees 100 plus rupees 100 plus rupees 50. So it will be rupees 250. So from the bill, you have to reduce the amount of rupees 250. So here we have approximated the bill amount to be 1000. So it's 1000 minus 250. So it will be rupees 750 approximately. So thus if your bill in a shop is rupees 999 and the shopkeeper gives a discount of 25% then the estimate the amount to be paid will be rupees 750. Next example is try finding 15% of rupees 375. So now the price is rupees 375 and the discount percent is 15%. So we know that discount equal to price into discount percent. So here the price is 375. And the discount percent is 15 percent. So that can be written as 15 into 1 divided by 100. So 375 into 15 divided by 100. 375 into 15 is 5625 divided by 100. So it will be rupees 56.25. So thus 15% of rupees 375 is rupees 56.25. The same you can do it by splitting the discount percent also. 10% then half of the 10% that is 5% then you have to add both the amounts. You can do it in either way. Hope you have understood how to find the or estimate the discount amounts. Thank you for watching the video.